so this here is the bottle connectors these are the connectors that are being connected to the bottle that is the cylinder the oxygen cylinders you connect these connectors to the oxygen cylinders which then you open these parts for the oxygen to be transferred into the building so we use this this is where we fix we fit in the oxygen cylinders and we use it to strap it to prevent it from falling or movement when delivering the oxygen the oxygen goes through here and enters into this manifold I already showed you this manifold already it enters into this manifold it enters into this manifold which then pass through gauges and all this mechanism valves there are valve gauges and it goes through from here it goes through from there you see then it runs through to the building we have the second manifold over here as well these are the connectors as well to connect the oxygen cylinders and this right here is the <coughs> this right here is the second manifold this right here is the second manifold as well each manifold each manifold has an oxygen alarm system below it and this oxygen alarm system like I say detects low pressure or no oxygen at all that's what these are used for for now there is no oxygen connected that's why we are seeing those alarm that there is low pressure which means no oxygen connected to it so these are the valves to open the oxygen supply or to lock it these are the gauges to read the bars how many bars is the oxygen delivering to the system <clears throat> when you come here we have this this machine here yeah, this is the pump, the, the motor of this machine. So, this produces medical oxygen, which is being sent into the. It is used for special kind of procedures in the theater. This is the first of the machine. It also has an oxygen alarm in it. This right here is AGSS also used for special procedures in the theater oxygen it produces oxygen air and this also as well so this is the oxygen building where oxygen is being produced and oxygen is being connected to the theater and the ICU